I headed east again this week to fulfill my responsibility of attending the annual CRF board meeting. This year we've elected a new president and welcomed a new board member, but whenever I travel to cave country, my mind is always preoccupied with the prospect of exploration. New Discovery is a section of Mammoth Cave that was discovered 80 years ago by guides Leo Hunt and Pete Hansen, and the publicity surrounding that discovery directly helped turn Mammoth Cave into a national park. The CCC started developing New Discovery as a commercial tour area, but Pearl Harbor caused most of these trail builders to join the war effort, and the area was never open to the public. New Discovery is well known for its spectacular gypsum deposits. Areas like Paradise have some of the best gypsum flowers anywhere in Mammoth Cave. The area has been restricted to research purposes, in part to minimize impact to these unique formations. The mapping effort has been on hold for nearly 40 years, but I was recently asked to continue the survey, exploration, and cartography of the most distant part of New Discovery, which is the westernmost part of the entire cave system. Most of the survey notes aren't up to modern standards, so a detailed and accurate map will require some initial resurvey. CRF cavers had not visited the area since 1979, so there was very little information about any difficulties. Between two teams, we managed to put 3,300 feet of survey in the book. We'll be back soon to continue the survey and begin to push leads in the hope of finding a way into the largely unexplored limestone of Joppa Ridge to the west.
Thank you.